we've all ignored medical symptoms from time to time, usually without dire consequences. Let's not kid ourselves, it's much easier to avoid the doctor than to be told that what you're secretly worried about is nothing. But there are some symptoms for which you should see a doctor without hesitation. Paying attention to seemingly minor ailments can sometimes prevent a visit to the emergency room or identify more serious problems. So when should you be sure to see a doctor? Here are six warning signs you should never ignore. Number one, chest pain. The stabbing pain in your chest may actually be a heart attack, the kind you often see on TV shows. So if you feel a squeezing sensation in your chest, call 911. If the pain is less severe but keeps coming back, you should also call your doctor. And don't assume that a heart attack always feels in your chest. Symptoms such as back pain, nausea, jaw pain or extreme fatigue, may indicate that your heart is in distress. Number 2. Severe Headache If you suddenly have a headache that you can only describe as the worst pain of your life, call 911 immediately. You may have an aneurysm, a weak spot in the wall of an artery that supplies blood to the brain. If you start having regular headaches, you should also see your doctor. They could be a sign of a brain tumor, problems with your vision, or a number of other factors. Number 3. Numbness in your hands or feet If you experience numbness, weakness or tingling in your hands or feet, or have lost strength, for example, when climbing stairs, you may have a herniated or bulging disc in your vertebra that is pressing on your nerve. And that nerve can be damaged as a result. Number 4. Leg pain with swelling. If you notice swelling in your calf that is accompanied by a painful feeling of pressure, call your doctor or go to the nearest emergency room. The symptoms indicate a blood clot in your leg. This is a dangerous condition because if the clot breaks loose and travels to your lungs, it can be fatal. Number 5. Excessive fatigue. Everyone's energy level is different, especially as they age. But if you find that you suddenly can't maintain your pace of life, your body may be trying to tell you something. Your doctor can test you for anemia. You could have Lyme disease or a malignancy. Your hormones could be out of whack. It could also be a sign of a heart attack. And number six, bleeding after menopause. If you're not supposed to be bleeding and you are, that's a problem. If you have bleeding in the middle of your cycle and don't take the pill, it's not normal. If you are perimenopausal, your periods may be closer together or further apart, but you should not have bleeding in between. Do you still want to know what foods you should eat to clean your arteries? Then be sure to watch the video that we link to you here. If you like the video then I would be really happy about a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any new video.